Charge Shot. Okay, welcome to Charge Shot League, everybody. Welcome back, guys. Playing more Rocket League all the time. The greatest game ever made. We're just trying to get you some candy corn so you can get some decryptor. I don't like candy corn that much, Brian. Neither do I. Candy corn is like the worst fucking candy. Well, actually, I would be honest. I would totally go for a little bit of candy corn right now if I was offered. <laughs> I, I think it's the worst candy. I don't like it at all. It, it's, it, it tastes like I'm eating plastic. Yeah, that's why I don't like candy corn. Oh, sorry. I get really pumped up with this game. Fuck. No, 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 no. <laughs> I tried. I'm, I was trying so hard. Me and him I, both hit it right there. That's what happened. I was rushing. He's got that new car, the Nissan. I, I was rushing so much. I still talk like this. Do you know? If you talk like that, can I talk like this? Yes. <laughs> hey, Luigi. Hey, Luigi, it's okay that Mario... Oh, shit. N remember when the Game Grumps actually did things? Yeah, remember when I actually tried? Remember when they were a little funny? Nah, you mean like, oh, oh wait, they're not funny anymore. I can't laugh at any Game Grump shit anymore. <laughs> that new show they got looks a just horrible. You mean the podcast? No, Game On. It's like a YouTube Red series. Oh yeah, I saw a little. I saw the first episode. A reminder: the trailer has them with a bong on their table, but the bong had no water in it. <laughs> yeah, I saw that too, but I didn't notice that. I don't smoke, so. <laughs> no, oh, it's just funny that the bong had no water in it. You can't use it. <laughs> it's unusable. They'll probably just put water in it themselves, can't they? Yeah, true, but it looks like they're in the middle of a big session of stuff, and I feel like they just, they didn't set it up right. Probably not. They obviously don't know, because Aaron said many times that he doesn't smoke or do drugs. The first time he um he said he used it, that Ross fucked it up for him. Really? Yeah. Because he fucked up. You don't have an edible as the first time experiencing weed. You don't do that. Oh. Then I guess my experiences don't matter. <laughs> yeah, that, that, it's a, it's never good. You keep hitting me. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh, oh man! I'm sorry. Yikes! I want to see this. Watch how it happened. No, I don't want to watch. <laughs> yeah, you bumped me out of the way when I was trying to go to it. We have so, to watch. This is how you learn to get good. After I finished Jimmy Neutron Attack of the Twonkies, got another game planned out. Ooh. Mind if I ask what it is? I think I want to play Astro Boy Omega Factor. Because I know that game very well. If you know it well, let's yeah, do it. I'm finally back to kick some tail. What? And he's finally he here. Gun. He fired his spurts. <laughs> if see, he shoots see. you, it's a coconut gun. Oh, well, man. Coconut gun. I suck at this game today. Nah, I suck at it. I'm, I'm only this five hour energy now. I'm only platinum, Frankie. I suck at it. Don't forget, it's your turn to go. <sighs> okay, I just drank a whole five hour energy in the in the midst of that replay. But We're doesn't good, doesn't good. five hour we, energy we suck? This. Look at this! Look at this fucking loser standing there. Oh. oh, here he goes. Ooh, oh, he, that's why he was standing there. He's faking us out, Brian. He was faking us out. I'm surprised. Whew. <laughs> I don't think we can turn this around, but I'm still going to the end for the items. Yeah, I wouldn't quit halfway through anyway. I'm just going to be a motherfucking goalie. I don't think that would work well. Cause I, cause I, I set up like a lot of passes to you. Oh Aww. shit! I could have had... angled myself a little better. I could have had that. Sorry. Or let me get it, cause I was right there. Sorry, I'm not good at angles. I'll get better. You'd think over like five or six episodes of Charge Shot League, I would have gotten better. You'd think that, but I'd be, I wouldn't be surprised. Not to mention, we have like five other fucking. Rocket League videos before we started Charge Shot League. Oh my god. 
And well, we also used to play on Game Eaters too. Yeah, well, we only had like one episode of that on Game Eaters. One or two or ten. I have like 450 hours in this fucking game. I have like maybe 20 hours. <laughs> but you say you play it on Xbox, Xbox One sometimes. Yeah. Well, I can't anymore. I lost my Xbox Live. Oh, Fuck. come on, these fucking assholes. That was my fault. No, it's not your fault. It's these guys' fault. Fuck them. <laughs> we gotta strat it. Sorry, the cat's trying to jump on the keyboard. Don't let it. Don't let it bite you. Spotted it's by her. Kitty, I got it. Sit on the fucking desk, cat. Don't sit on the keyboard. Kitty, I want to pet the kitty. Hey, <laughs> hey. I want to pet the pretty kitty. Hey. <laughs> Fuck, I missed. I wonder if Mr. Kakashka is gonna be in the jungle movie. I don't know, cause he's dead. His voice is dead. Dude, that... you not... Dude, you could replicate that man's voice. Pretty well, too. Oh, Someone stopped it, thank God. It was Someone me! My wall. It was me, Austin. Fuck, I missed. Is it bad to always have ball cam on? No. Because that's how I play. I always have ball cam on. You could switch it off really quick with the Y button. Yeah, triangle. I'm using a PS4 controller. Oh, shit. Sometimes you need it off for different things, like if you learn how to dribble. I've only ever done a dribble once. I swear to God, it was fucking awesome. It was pure luck, because I didn't know what I was doing. I was just like, eh, eh. Fuck, if I aimed that right. Woo! La da dee diddle. La da la do. It's okay. I'll be here next time. <laughs> <laughs> we'll. We'll finally pull it off, Peter. Yeah, we'll kick the races, Peter. Oh fuck! If you aimed that right, that would have been I in. Could have had it, but I didn't. But I missed. Dang it! Damn, everyone is at the ball at once. You see that? I did. Everybody All likes four balls. Of us were ball hopping. Everybody likes balls. You know what they say? You know what they say? All toasters. And they they do something. <laughs> we could we didn't stop fucking with the ball. I think we should find the other people. Shut up. Oh, I got three. Who are you talking cones. to, Scott? You. I'm recording you, dumb fuck. You shut up. I am got thermal purple. All right. I, I was le gonna say leave them. Oh fuck! I just chose ready, Brian. Ready player one. It's taking me into another two versus two. Are you there or no? I'll shut your fucking computer off, cunt! I'll kick your ass. Shut the fuck up. What? I gotta leave the match. You're not you in this one. Dumbass, Do it. Told him to be quiet. You be quiet. You're the one yelling at the game. Let me know when you're on the main menu. Yeah, I'm back at the main menu now. Okay. I am ready, Freddy. All right, what a try. How many candy corn you got now? 20. Oh, man, getting you up to 50 is going to be forever. Not if I play while you aren't around. You know, that's a good point. I've got time to fly. You know what sucks? You can only what? get up to 9,999 crates. Shit. Well, that that's quite a lot of fucking crates, dude. If, if I play non-stop, maybe I'll be able to manage that. Non-stop. He's a monster mash. It was a graveyard smash. Oh, yeah. It's Halloween in, in a few days. Yeah, too bad I didn't play any spooky games. I, I just uh, haven't felt it. October has not been a very good month for Frankie Lee. Hey, we can always play Shadow Showdown. That game is spooky, right? Yeah, cause it's fu it's a it's a Butch Hartman creation. And it's no, Butch, Hart Butch Hartman's pretty cool. He's okay. And it's fairly odd parents. That makes it spooky. Like guys, we are fucking uh, partnered by Frederator. We gotta watch what we say. <laughs> I don't think anyone. I don't think they care. I don't think they watch our videos. Frederator's pretty lit. They made Chalk Zone, dude. 
<laughs> weren't you <laughs> weren't you gonna play a Togs on Flash game? Yeah, it's that one I played for my boyhood. Yeah, I went you... to Wendy's and got a cheat code in my kids' meal, and I was like, "No way!" And the kids at school were all mad at me because I wouldn't tell them the cheat code. I thought you said only a few people were mad at you. Well, yeah, not the whole class. But I pa I kids. pass it to him. I'm a dumb fuck. Yeah, yeah, it wasn't a bunch of kids. It was maybe like four, or five. It was like two or three. Yeah, it wasn't many, but it felt like a lot because they were always hovering around, trying to watch my inputs on the keyboard when I put in the code, and I wouldn't let them see it. They actually did that? Yeah, they would hover around me. How it was pathetic. like a fucking Jock Zone Flash game! How pathetic, as in the words of uh, Patrick Starr. No, you know what's really pathetic? Um, I was a poor kid, but I was the first kid in my class to have a PSP. And they would just hover around me all day while I played it during uh, like lunchtime. And I remember t um, I got in trouble because I physically told someone to fuck off. <laughs> Because they were watching you play, right? Yeah, and my principal let me off the hook. She's like, no, I I, I understand you. <laughs> she better understand you. My principal was actually pretty nice. Um, I was uh, like one of the poorest kids in the school, and I remember I was like, um, during class, asking if anyone wanted their uh, lawns mowed after school, and I could do it for them, and no one wanted me to help. So I was like, okay. So I was like, Oh, I wish I could just save up for this game. It was in a book order, like how they had scholastic book orders. They had, oh, wait, a, it was one of those game catalogs? Yeah, and it was a three-pack of PS2 Crash Bandicoot games. And my fucking principal bought it for me and came to my house with it. Really? And I was so goddamn happy. I was like, no way! I was like, how'd you even know? And she's like, well, uh, your teacher saw you fantasizing over this every day. And I was like, no, it was like some fucking mir Christmas miracle shit. Now that is awesome. You had an awesome principal person. Yeah. I was a very troubled child, so I was always around the principal's office. But they me never treated me horribly in the principal's office. I was always in detention because I never did homework. Um, I got in a lot of trouble because my grandma pampered me a lot. And, um... When I would have homework, I, and I came home from school, she would insist I sit down and go do whatever I want for the day, and she did my homework for me. Really? <laughs> yes. Your grandma was fucking awesome. And uh, it got to the point where they're like, Frank, we know the handwriting on this is different. Who's doing your homework for you? I was like, no, it's me, look. And I tried to replicate it and looked like such a fucking idiot. Oh, God. And then I, I, they figured it out it was your grandma? Uh, I eventually told them because I didn't want to get in deeper shit. You didn't know any of the stuff that they were going over, right? <laughs> yeah, I didn't know jack fucking shit, dude. Every single year I was in school, since kindergarten, my math grades were Fs. Holy shit. Every single one. Never have I gotten anything other than an F in math. Not even kidding. Math was one of those ones where I was good at. As one of the fattest fucking kids in my school, like, I think I was the biggest kid in that school, or biggest person even. And for some reason, I excelled in PE. Maybe that's a calling. Maybe that's your <laughs> true calling. No, no, no. No, maybe not. <laughs> but for some reason, I always got good grades in PE. It was never straight A's, but there were good grades. Like, I was getting B's. I was getting a C+. Plus. How could you do bad in PE is my question. Dude, I'm a fat fuck. There's plenty of ways I could do horrible in PE. You need to remind you, I was like 250 pounds when I was in fucking just fifth grade. Fuck, I couldn't save that. No, I was I, a big child. I was up there too, though, because I'm way fatter than you. And, uh... I always did good in art class, but they didn't like um, how many times I would draw on my homework. I got in a lot of trouble for that. Oh, you would draw all over your homework? <laughs> yeah. I, w I was always drawing aliens and, like, uh, little mini Frankie things. Oh, fuck. My phone is turning off. It my, died. Uh, my phone actually buzzed earlier. I, I should have turned it off when we started. My notification sound is the Game Boy, like, ding. <laughs> 
I noticed that one time when we were recording something, I think. Ooh, Brian! Oh, I got an assist. It was all uh, his fault for missing it, though. I've got assist. Are you assist? I've got assist on my back. No, oh, God, that sounds gross. That it is gross. Why did you say it? Now it won't get out of my head, boy. I don't actually have assist, Brian. I don't care. You, uh, you do in my brain now. Well, it's canon, everybody. Frankie's got assist. It's not going anywhere. His name's Filbert, and it's going to be on the show next week. Is it a turtle? No. <laughs> what? Is it a turtle from Rocco's Modern Life? No. That was Filbert. Turn <laughs> the page, wash your hands. Turn the page, wash your hands. I remember that. Rocco's Modern Life held up, held up decently. But uh, cat dog, uh-uh. Uh-uh. Hey, a cat butt! I fucking hate cat dog. I helped him launch it. I fucking hate cat dog. I helped him launch it right here. Oh, man. We lost this one. We lost big time. <laughs> oh, sorry. I just did, like, the sick kid nose sound. I just snorted a snot. I am sorry. I got the three candy corn. I got corn. seven candy corn, bruh. Whoa. And I got a Hot Wheels topper. I'm gonna ready you get up again. <laughs> yeah, ready. I am absolutely ready. Uh, Fuck, I was- my charge shot, uh, we'll play Cuphead. Cuphead? Not, episode's not done yet. <laughs> Man, if Next we- if we did Next play Cuphead, shot, we'll play um, Cat Dog Search for the Golden Hydrant for PC. <laughs> Is that a real thing? Yes, that's a real game. I played it. I think I know what you're playing next. No, I'm not playing Cat Dog. <laughs> hey, you cat butt! And then there was the one guy named Lube that was really stupid. Just like, duh. His name was Lube, dude. Yeah, it was. And he's like, duh. Hey, you cat butt. There's an episode called All You Need Is Lube. I always thought that was funny. So I had a VHS of it. I forgot what happens. I think they save his life and he acts like he's in debt to them. Oh, yeah, and then he tries to save their lives. Yeah, he tries to save their lives so he can get out of it or something. Or they want him to go away so they make it like he, that he <laughs> saved their lives. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know how I remember that because I never rewatched many episodes of Cat Dog. Oh, you know what? I had I had a VHS with that episode on it. That's why. Duh! Hey, you cat butt. When I was a kid, I um had a lot of VHSs, and I used to rewatch like everything I had. Cause I didn't have cable. Did how many? Did you ever have the Nickelodeon ones? Those were the best to have because they were they Plenty were friggin' years. orange. And every single Rugrats VHS had the same Peanuts commercial. Oh, yeah, score. Peanuts? You mean, uh... Yeah, like Charlie Brown. Did you hear his house, like, uh, burnt down recently? Yeah, Charles Schultz's, um, home where he had everything got burned down in a forest fire. And a lot, a lot of valuable things were lost. Lost to time, Brian. Lost to time. The Charles Schultz Museum was right near it, but it's, uh... Oh. It was safe from what I hear. Woo! We flung that thing. Whoa, you got it. <gasps> Shit! No, he's going for it, Brian! He's going for it! Okay, you got it. You saved the Fuck. ball, bro. These guys yeah. are like one Ooh. step ahead. Oh. How do I get one step ahead? One step ahead of the bread line. Ooh, there's no bread. The they had me kick. Like that other guy we were just against. He was also Brian. Let's play Aladdin for Sega Genesis. You can play it. Oh. Ah, almost had it. You know me. Not the Sega Genesis guy. I know. I gotta open you up to more Sega games. Fuck. I was trying to hit it no, backwards. There are only like two Sega games I would recommend I want you to play for the channel. That's all I could think of. There's one Sega game that I actually did want to play. Which one? Beyond Oasis. The only ones I'm thinking are really good platforms. Um, Dynamite Heady and Rystar. 
I got no idea what those are. They are very good games. I thought you would have wanted me to play Sonic 2. No, Sonic 2 is... Well, yeah. Well, I don't just want... Well, yeah, that, yeah, I'd say play Sonic 2. I had to think about that for a minute. Sonic 2 is the best 2D Sonic other than Mania. Ooh, nice save. Whew. Maybe I can make a donk. No, I Fuck, I almost had it and I got bumped. Did I do it again? <gasps> <gasps> Fucking shit! <laughs> Fuck! You saved it for them. Why was I there? Brian! That's a good question, Frankie. One that I can't answer. Brian, why was I there? I don't know. You tell me. Fuck. Oh my god. Is this guy in the man- Yes, he's in the mantis, it looks like. I don't know. Like, next time we play, can we change our usernames to Cosmo and Wanda? That was one of my ideas, I think, wasn't it? Yeah. Oh, do you ever notice in uh, Fairly Odd Parents is a running gag of Timmy's dad going, Oh, Timmy! <laughs> Every time. Oh, Timmy! It's the same tone. Oh, Timmy! Yeah, it's just his repeated inflection of his voice. Dude, I, I, we're, no, the thing is, I know it's not uh, them repeating the same voice clip either. He's saying it every time. Yeah, I know. It's always a slightly different tone, but it's he says it every time. It's, oh, Timmy. <laughs> I always find it funny. Timmy. Timmy Turner Man, wishing for... breaking the rules for Game Boy Advance. Is that we a real tried thing? That. Yeah, remember we tried it and it sucked ass. Yes. I didn't even um I didn't even finish uh, recording it. I think I erased it a long time ago. Damn it! Why you do that? I was ashamed of it. It was a really bad recording. <laughs> it was the only recording I ever purposely erased. I still have recordings from like 2014. No, but I never purposely erase a recording. That one is bad, dude. <laughs> it wasn't a good game or a good. The recording was kind of boring too. We didn't say much funny. Same reason I want to restart Sonic Adventure. We we um we have recordings of Sonic Adventure like a good two or three episodes, the first Sonic Adventure. But we didn't say anything noteworthy. We were not on our game at all. We were really boring and sounded tired. That's me all the time though. No, but like even me. Usually I try and carry us around when we're tired. But no, this one is really boring. Six candy corn. Ooh, you're actually making it faster because you get- that's like an extra bonus. Yes. Let's- let's do one more round. I'm feeling spry. Alright, let's see how many you got after. If you have Thanks enough. Brian, Brian. That was my phone again. I'm turning the notification sound off. That's a good call, Frankie. A good call. Sorry about that. After this, I'm gonna go get lunch. Whoa! Hua! Hua! I feel oh like I feel like these guys don't exactly know what they're going to going for. They don't know what they're doing at all. We should we should play Magic Sword again. You you know what I really hated? What? The first episode of Fairly Odd Parents, Chloe was in. She was a fucking piece of shit. She was. Didn't she make like a ton of wishes? No, there's a monster attacking Dimsdale, and she instead of helping get rid of it, saves it. Is like, it's okay, Mr. Monster. You're just here to destroy our city. What and the she like fuck? hugs it and then it goes off and destroys the city. She heals a damaged monster, Brian. <laughs> Why does she heal it? I don't know, but during a podcast, even um, Butch Hartman does not like or care for Chloe. <laughs> <laughs> we just gotta win by forfeit. Why did, uh, they add her? Bush Hartman doesn't even like her. Let's go to main he said, menu. He said it was kind of, a uh, Nickelodeon said you gotta add a new character. You gotta do something to keep the show fresh. Damn it, that when sucks. They, one season ago, they just added Sparky. How many Super candy corn you got? Bag. Uh, let me see. Let me check my dosh. Yeah. I got 34. Shit, you're almost up to one decryptor. I got rule 34 candy corn. You have a, you have crates, right? Uh, yeah, most likely. If you didn't give them all to me, which I know you did, so I could open them on an episode once. Yeah, I have one crate. If you get a decryptor, you could open it. I want to open it. Want to do like one more? 
Yeah, let's do one more match and then I I, I want to. I am dead hungry. Yeah, me too. I could go for some macaroni and cheese. I could go for food. All I know is I don't want to ever eat another fucking bologna sandwich ever. Why? It sounds like you got I, a story to tell. I don't care how bad things get. Going through poverty so many times, you just don't want to eat a fucking bologna sandwich ever again. That's a nice story, Frankie. You just don't. When you're at the low SLO and you're at the end of the month where you ain't got no money or hardly anything, you want nothing to fucking do with bologna. I know that feeling. Growing but I will up. I'll say, I can't eat bologna anymore without it feeling like I'm eating wet skin. But, uh. The bologna I get from Aldi is pretty good. Aldi has some good food. Aldi has the best bootleg generic food. Them Clancy chips, goddamn, bruh. I actually want to go now. That's a good idea. This episode is sponsored by Aldi. Right. Our brand new sponsor. We're, we're this episode is sponsored and brought to you by Audible.com. Get a free audiobook download at audibletrial.com slash charge shot. Oh my fucking god. Imagine if we sold out like that. Imagine if we actually could do that. To be honest, I would sell out as hard as we fucking could, man. I would sell out just a little bit at least. I'd you know, sell you gotta pedal to the metal. If you want to make it in this world, you gotta be kind of a scumbag. Oh, I'm okay with that. That explains how Aaron got far. Sorry. <laughs> you gotta be the scum of the earth to get to the top. You gotta sleaze your way to the top. You must seize it. Do you have what it takes to be a man? I'm ready to sleaze my way to the top, Frankie. I'm ready to seize it. Grasp it. Firmly? No, no, no. Not like that, Brian. Not like that. <laughs> Oh, you scored us a shot. I did, because these guys hesitated. Wow! Do you know how many times... If, if I played Cuphead for a charge shot, do you know how many times I'd be name-dropping us because I used the charge shot weapon? How many times? Would it be constant? I ran the whole game with the charge shot weapon. Ooh, that hit. Woo! Woo, that hit. Mm, you bet. I love making that reference. Fucking uh, Misadventures of Skooks is an absolute legendary YouTube poop series. I remember when they were still coming out with them. Or when Orpheus for the Wind was still working on them. Yes, I was so hyped for that last episode. <laughs> I was too. I was hyped for Hey, that guy is George Costanza with Windows logo on him. He, he's got that aesthetic Windows XP logo. I thought it was like Windows 90, 98 yeah, or something. Yeah, Windows some 98, shit. Windows XP, 95. Windows ME, Windows NT. No, that's... There's Windows 8 and Windows 10, but where's Windows 9? There is a Windows 9. No, there isn't. No way. It's like uh, unofficially uh, called uh, that. I haven't seen it anywhere. It's unofficially called that. It's uh, it's uh, for stores and shit. Well, shit. I want Windows 9. It's like a commercial thing. I'll go to the Pirate Bay and look for Windows 9, and I'll dox my computer. It's like, I'm gonna dox myself. Do it. Tell the internet exactly who you really are. My name is Liam Elroy. He's Elric, the Dragon Prince. That's you. You know it'd be funny? You know how there's, um, in Rick and Morty, there's, like, an Im and m millions of different Ricks? Yep. That really takes place for the fact, if someone on Halloween is going as Rick, it doesn't matter how they look, it, it can be canon. <laughs> yeah, that's a good point. I'll go as Rick. There's infinite universes. Everyone could possibly be Rick, Brian. Dude, watch this <laughs> shot. Brian, I am fucking Rick. I am Rick. <laughs> <laughs> I'm oh, Rick. Sorry. <laughs> I almost started a whole joke tangent and I just stopped myself. <laughs> Are you Pickle Rick? I'm Zeta C 13 B Rick, Brian. Please don't be. B Ryan, Brian. 
I'm the only Brian that exists. You're the only Brian in the multiverse. Every other Brian is a fake! Good. Made by the government. Every other Brian is a knockoff of me. Every other Brian in the world was created to try and rival your charge shot league, your rocket league skills. That seems apparent because we keep going against people that say they're Brian. Yeah. They're all trying to defeat you, but they have you have gone undeterred. Undeterred. Und you have been deterred. Undeterred is a fun word. It's like, undeterred. I am the turd. Get out of my room, turd! Right. <laughs> oh, okay, yeah. No. South Park. Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. I bumped you, like, twice. Thrice. Yeah, I miss, um... Whenever they had a chance in South Park for Randy Marsh to go, Shelly, we gotta go! I'm like, Shelly! Like how we go, Sharon! Oh my god. We gotta, we gotta tie. Yeah, I'm try I was trying to fucking do this here, but you bumped me right there. A little one. I, I get in your way a little too much. Just sit in the back. No, I'm just kidding. Don't. You gotta chase the ball I'm sometimes. I'm sit in the back seat of the car. Like, all right, Brian, you control the control stick and I will accelerate. We'll control the same car. <laughs> that sounds like a video idea if I ever met you in person. If I ever lived to be 40, I'll probably make it to 40. I'll probably make it to 50. You'll probably make it more than 50. I'll probably even make it that to was That 70. was a sweet double hit. That was a double squink. It was. Nobody would have expected that. Got a good old squinter on him. Ah, uh, you words. go. I'll stay back. I'll stay back. I don't want them scoring. <laughs> I got a nunchuck, y'all. I want to whittly whack these motherfuckers in my damn Hot Wheel ass looking car. Brian! <laughs> damn, that was sweet. Dude, Bitch, I, un I, unle I unleashed the beast. Look at that replay. Look at that. Look at that shit. <laughs> Fuck! Look at that shit! Unleash the evil! See why you're the only Brian who can beat the game in this episode? Hey, I think we already did beat it. These fucking guys need to give up. We've won. Pretty much. I can just stand still right here and do nothing. Match. Well, there's only four seconds left. There's four seconds. They can't turn this around. We won. We did. We beat the game. Yeah, you're right. He is an asshole. You're correct. I got six candy corns. <laughs> Look at our Rhino scores. Horn. I got Rhino Horn Topper for my car. Frankie. I got the corn and then I got the gahorn. Look at our score. Look at our scores. That's a pretty good score. I have like ten times more than you. God damn it. All right. I uh, next time on Charge Shot, everybody. Next time, y'all. We'll save. We'll get the crown, save the town, and eat some ass. Wait, wait. How many candy corn you got first? Uh, forty. Oh shit! You're almost there. Almost there. A couple more games, you'll have enough for a decryptor.